Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and a nice video is about dynamic guidelines, and I'm not a big fan of them. Uh, the only reason I really know about them is because I had a, somebody emailed me trying to cut them off one time because they were bugging them. And they do serve their purpose, uh, but I don't, I'm not, a, like I said, I'm not a big fan of them. But if you wanted to move this object, at a 45 degree angle away from this other object, the dynamic guidelines would help you and you can turn them on and off and just go to view and turn on dynamic guidelines. And then when you grab that and touch it, you get some lines. And you can see as long as you stay on that line, the guidelines stay there. So that one is perfectly aligned from the other one. And we'll just draw two lines. And you can see that. And it does it in all directions. And it can do it from the center of the outside. And if you need to move it over here, you can see it line up. You can actually do it from the center. You know, I'm grabbing the center and then it gets a line. And, and there's a line right there. So it, it does have its purpose. And you can change some things. You can go to Windows, Dockers, Align, and uh, Dynamic uh, as long as this is checked, you can change the degrees. You can change the color of your line. You know, make it a, a red so it might stick out more. You can make it a solid line. You can make it a dashed line. And uh, now, so we've changed it to red. Let's see what it looks like. And there's a red line, probably easier to see in the video. But if you just need to move it down uh, like that, it would be pretty easy. Now, you know, like in this case, if you just needed to move it over, even without the guidelines. So let's turn them off and just a quick little side note, go under view and turn them off. If you had three objects and you wanted them all equal on the top, just select them all and hit T on the keyboard and it brings them all to the top so it does align them that way. They do have their purpose, I just don't use them. But I thought I'd throw that out there. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.